The second annual Leading the Charge electric car road trip reached central Whangarei today with a gathering at the Canopy Bridge and Cameron Street Mall and also bringing a touch of Hollywood. Among the roadshow participants was documentary producer and star of Who Killed the Electric Car, Chelsea Sexton. We spoke to Chelsea about how she likes her Northland experience thus far and what she sees as the future for electric cars in Northland. Well, I like torque and horsepower more than anybody rightfully should, so I am drawn to the performance of electric cars. Um, they're quick, they're quiet, they're smooth. Most of them are very, very fast, uh, but other people love them because they're also very environmentally friendly. They, are, they use domestic energy, they're much cheaper to drive, and it's money we're not sending overseas and elsewhere. So there's a whole bunch of different reasons to like them, and whichever one works for you is fine by me. <laughs> EVs are growing slowly, electric vehicles are growing slowly in the marketplace, but the big, there's two main issues. Number one is lack of product, and by that I mean variety. So there's no single gas car or petrol car that works for absolutely everybody, and there's not going to be a single EV that suits everybody either. So we need a variety of vehicles in different body styles, different price ranges, different performance, all of those sorts of things for people to be able to pick what really works for them. Electric cars are so much cleaner than petrol cars, especially in a country like New Zealand that's already 80% renewable energy. So it's not only cheaper to drive, it's much cleaner to drive. Most electric vehicles don't use any petrol at all. A few use both. So there's zero emission. And you're only a matter of trying to, to manage or mitigate whatever the power plant is producing. And if you're already starting with hydro or wind or solar or something significantly clean, it's not an issue at all. I love the trip. I mean, this is such an ideal place for electric cars, and I love how community-driven it is. You know, people sort of think, oh, there's only a thousand electric cars in New Zealand, and yet it's doubling every year. So it's, it's exciting to see the energy around electric cars here, and the interest of the utilities, and how supportive companies like North Power are, and ChargeNet, and all the different players sort of coming together with such enthusiasm and passion towards, we're going to really make this work.